Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. So happy to have you with us again today. We are hanging out here at Rusty Taco in Gilbert with Daniel, the operating partner slash taco guru. Uh, just to check out this restaurant, it's a really cool place if you guys haven't been here before. It's a unique concept. It's just a fun place to hang out. And it's located right here in the Santan Village area. So it's really uh, convenient if you're in Gilbert. And even if you're not, we're right off the freeway. So, Daniel, thanks for hanging out with us today. Appreciate it. Yeah, pleasure. Thanks Tell us for a little uh, coming about, by. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Tell us a little bit about Rusty Taco and sure. kind of where it came from and what got you into this. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, so Rusty Taco is a, a you know, casual uh, taco taco. Uh, place it's a you know your neighborhood taco joint uh, we opened this location here in Gilbert in uh, early 2019 in February um, and uh, yeah it's a uh, delicious uh, tacos served quick uh, and a nice place to hang out and um, you know people here in Gilbert seem to seem to love us and yeah. we actually just opened our second location over in uh, Scottsdale as well oh awesome uh, just kind of off the uh, the 101 uh, and Via de Ventura uh, over there so we'll see even if you're not in Gilbert you got one you got one up <laughs> we in got Scottsdale two now, now yeah so, so. there you go <laughs> So, um, what got, were you doing this? Were you a restaurant tour before, or did yeah, you come I from was. another field? Yeah, I was. So I've ran a number of different restaurants around town. Uh, worked with uh, Fox restaurants for a while. Um, you know, ran an Irish pub on Mill Avenue called Rula Bula for okay. a long time. If you're All familiar right. with it. Yep. Uh, and you know, just fell in love with this industry and just connecting with people, uh, serving great food, smiles with it, and uh, you know, decided. It was time to kind of venture out and, and open my own place, and, and uh, here we are. I'm glad there's people like you. I have a degree in hotel restaurant management. Very good. You can see that I'm, <laughs> how much I'm using that now. Oh, yes, absolutely. But uh, <laughs> some of us thought we could do it and couldn't hang, and you're, you're hanging well, so that's good. Yeah, so. well, I appreciate that. I know it's a, it's a tough industry. It's it's definitely not for everybody, but mm -hmm. uh, you know, once you fall in love with it and commit, yeah. it's just uh, there's really no turning back. I had all kinds of fun. It just the schedule was a bit rough, as I'm <laughs> sure you're aware of, Yeah, so. it can be tough. So, Tell us about kind of the process here. It's all very fresh from what I, I've been here several times. My wife's yeah, addicted, by the way. Cool. Well, appreciate so, that. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, fresh. Yeah, really fresh. Uh, we do everything from scratch. So, our salsas are made from scratch. Our sauces are made from scratch. You know, everything that comes in the back door is all just raw, fresh ingredients, fresh produce, um, which, you know, you're not going to find at most uh, taco places, but you're also just you know not gonna find at most restaurants anymore it seems and you know we just try and do things the right way and you know we are just serving uh, you know tacos it's a very simple menu but we got a lot of unique choices um, and you know we're just uh, creates a little more work to do it that way yeah. uh, you know it's a little more preparation um, a little more time consuming but we think the end product is just better that way I, so, I agree with yeah. you on that. The end product is fantastic. Yeah, appreciate it. So um, obviously a little bit of a rough time this year for restaurants, but uh, those of those folks that are watching might want to know what you're doing here sure. to kind of help keep everyone safe and, and, and sanitary and all that yeah, good stuff. Yeah, so. absolutely. Um, no doubt it's been a really tough year on uh, really a lot of industries, but restaurants have been hit hard. And, um, you know, we're very, very blessed. Uh, Gilbert has continued to support us uh, extraordinarily well. Uh, even in kind of the, the early stages of this, when we were to go only, a lot of people came by and, and supported us and it meant a lot. And we, um, you know, we managed to, to pull through. And, you know, now that we're uh, back to some dining and, and, you know, still doing a lot of takeout, uh, you know, we've stabilized, which is which is huge. It's great. Uh, it is. And, you know, we, we have to keep half of our dining room closed. We've removed a lot of tables and um, really just, done our best to, to make sure that you know the the sanitary practice that we had already uh, we just upped our game on all of them made sure um, you know staff is wearing masks at all times social distancing and just trying to keep people safe right. so you know we uh, we have some some requirements that are uh, you know just for the good of uh, the customers you know we do ask people to wear masks when they are ordering uh, but you know once you're sat down and eating um, you know, you can take it off just like we are here yeah. um, and, and enjoy your meal. Um, yeah. So, yeah. Great. Well, yeah, I can attest. We came in, he was masked up, ready to go, and I was. we had to have a discussion about do we take the mask off, do we not? <laughs> so, uh, but, yeah, you have a great patio here. Yeah, beautiful. Um, it's, you know, 80 degrees right now it's in December. like even uh, have some December. Christmas lights up here. We do. We got some Christmas decorations. It's just a nice time to be sitting outside and, Definitely. and uh, you know, enjoying the weather while you can. Definitely. Well, so. if you could tell 
folks watching one thing about why they need to come check out Rusty Taco, what would it be? Oh gosh, um, you know, there's a lot of options for tacos. So we just try and be unique and do something a little different. Uh, and, you know, I think you can see that in our menu and just the, the types of products that we serve, you know, things like fried chicken tacos and barbecue brisket tacos and, um, you know, just, just some unique menu options. And we just try and have fun, you know, mm -hmm. at the end of the day, uh, everybody's lives are a little crazy right now. Uh, we want to be a place that people can come and de-stress and just enjoy themselves with their friends and family and grab a margarita and, and hang out on the patio, you know? Definitely. So hopefully we can provide that. Well, I appreciate you hanging with us. And yeah. on that note, he just mentioned all these different tacos and <laughs> margaritas. I'm going to hold off on the margarita, but I got to grab myself a taco. So Fair enough. again, I really appreciate you hanging out with yeah, us today. Thanks for and coming by. If you get a chance, check out, uh, check out Rusty Taco here at Santan Village or up in Scottsdale 101 in Via de Ventura. Um, so uh, we look forward to seeing you down here and, uh, again. And if you like content like this, please do share with your friends. Let them know about Rusty Taco. Tell them why they should check it out. And we'll see you again next time. Thanks.